You know, moments ago, someone introduced me here and he let the cat out of the bag. Believe me. He says, I did a bungee jump. I did a bungee jump. Okay. That was some time back. Don't worry. Uh, the truth is, like I said, when I started here, Islam is not all about doom and gloom. I remember when I did that jump last year sometime, I had a few Malaysian friends with me. And to be honest with you, I got messages from scholars of Islam, whom I look up to, to say, Sheikh, haram to Bilallah. It's totally forbidden and engage in tawbah to Allah. And I replied saying, Sheikh, I invite you to jump with me next year. <laughs> Subhanallah. Because to be honest with you, okay, we've taken all precautions and everything. It was something that just, I just needed to tick off my list and I got it ticked off. You know, skydiving is almost ticked off, inshallah, by the will of Allah. But there, it's actually a brother of mine who's blocking me. He's saying, look, there, there's no strings attached, brother. You know, here at least you've got strings. If you pull this thing and it doesn't go down, it doesn't open, what happens? And I say, look, what are the chances of it? Well, there are chances. So basically, we're still getting there. But the reason I'm saying this is, you can enjoy. You can enjoy your life. But within limits. Don't do something haram. Because if you do something haram, and I'm going to end with the statement, if you do something haram for the sake of enjoyment, it will bring about everything but enjoyment in your life. If you do something haram to make yourself happy, meaning something prohibited to make yourself happy, it will bring about everything but happiness. Remember this. So if you really want enjoyment and happiness, just make sure it is within the line and the limit such that when you leave the world, you will go a person who's utilized whatever time and space he's been given and whatever abilities he or she has been given in this short test known as life in the best way so that when we earn the certificate, it will be given to us in the right hand and we enter straight into paradise. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us all Jannah. I hope the few words that I've said have touched the heart. <laughs>